Um, the White House has made it very clear that it's on Republicans to avoid the government shutdown, not on the White House, but our latest polling shows that a higher percentage of Americans would actually blame the shutdown on the president and the Democrats, not on Republicans. Why do you think that is, and should the president be out there speaking more on this issue? We're going to be very clear. This is this is this will be a Republican shutdown, right? This is extreme House Republicans who have made it very clear that the, the chaos that we're seeing in the in the House, they are marching us towards a government shutdown. That shouldn't be happening. This shouldn't be happening. This is the job of Congress. One of the basic jobs of Congress is to keep the government open. A deal was made. I mean, I can't speak to your polling, but what I can speak is to the facts. If the shutdown, this, this Republican shutdown happens. So we're going to continue to be very clear about it. Uh, and it is, um, you know, it is something that they can fix. They can fix this. But does it show that the president needs to be messaging more to the public about this? I mean, look, the president was very clear. A strike could have potentially huge impacts for the economy. According to NBC News polling, 37 percent of registered voters just 37 percent proof of the president's handling of the economy. He's at a 56 percent disapproval, the highest of his presidency. And 74 percent of registered voters say they have major or moderate concerns about the president's age and mental fitness. How troubling is that? Here's what we're going to focus on. We're going to focus on exactly what you just asked me, right? The first question, which is how do we uh, how do we continue to support um, uh, the workers, right? We're not going to get into the litigation of uh, of the negotiations here, but what we're going to do is continue to show uh, how much this president is working for American families. You, and we saw inflation spike. We saw uh, we saw what's going on with what Americans are feeling every day. This is why. This is why this president has been so zeroed in, so laser focused on lowering costs for Americans. And we've done that. And a lot of the a lot of the policies that the president has put forward are indeed popular. I mean, Bidenomics is has worked so well that you have Republicans in their own districts, in their own states, taking credit for things that the president pushed forward, policies that the president has pushed forward, legislation that they didn't even vote for, if you think about the American Rescue Plan, the Inflation Reduction Act. So I get I get the I get the polling that you're laying out. I get that, but we we can't we can't be focused on that. We also have to be focused on really speaking directly to the American people. The next three days, you're going to see the president go to three states to do just that. But thirty-seven percent approve. I hear you. I hear you. But it is look. Our focus is going to be on um, on what we can do to continue to deliver for the American people. Polls are polls, right? They are going to be all over the place. Uh, they are going to, they're going to, um, you know, they don't tell the whole story, actually. And that is just the way a poll is. 